Hello everyone, Terry Cruz here, and this is NHL 24 on EA Sports. Hey everyone, Son of Beast here. Welcome to another NHL of the Rival Week. Now this next game, it is about to bring things on for this part of the week of the matchup of season number three, as we're about to be seeing the next two. This inbound is going to bring things on as we have the Hurricanes, the Storm, and they are taking on the other team that was going to happen before, by Vetchkin's team of the Washington Caps, also known as Capitals, with a full part of a name. Now here's what the story was. This year was in 2019, as the Capitals are the regioning Stanley Cup champions. And after years of disappointment in the postseason, this team is finally standing on the top of the hockey world. They're just trying to make them feel like that Barry, Barry Tots and the team decided to part ways. He would go on to lead the New York Islanders, the Capitals now being run by his former assistant Todd Burden. But a regular season, it was all that happened for he and his team did really well. At least, it wasn't the way that most of them did happen well. In the regular season, it was going to be the record of 48-26-8 run. Good for 104 points and for the winning of the divisions as the Caps earned the right to play the top of the wildcard team. That year was the team with the Carolina Hurricanes. It was the Canes' first playoff appearance since 2009, and it was led by someone very good young players. Sebastian Ajo, Teodoro Teravainen, Dougie Hamilton on defense, and rookie of Andrei Shnachikov. They've also had a couple of veterans, notable of Jordan Stahl and his former friend in Justin Williams. From his second season with the Carolina, it was all that has to be said, but you can't just make them establish the burst of the upcoming side. The region champions play playoff hockey is for the first time decade. This is where a rivalry was born. And as for you know, this is where it comes down. Andrei Shetchikov and Sebastian Ajo with Tara Vinen still continues to play with their team to this day. As the other team turned to be Alex Ovechkin's idea. He wants to come up a creation, so why don't we give this one a run? Well, might be a tough one to start from 2019. Here are the starting groups, Sebastian Ajo, Jacob Slavin, and Andrei Shnachikov. And for the cap side, Alex Ovechkin, John Carlson, and Tom Wilson. The starting goaltenders are in between Darcy Kilmer and the other side for the Kings is, is Anderson. Now let's head on down to Washington. As we see the next part of the commentary to the crew, I will have the next one up. OJ, along with the other two of Fan and the center ice, will be Boomer. I'll be back with the post game show. Guys, it's all yours. Let's do it from here. It's that time, folks. The rival week is on. OJ, along with Fan, and this is NHL on EA Sports. Let's do this in District of Columbia. We start on the run on the start run. We start off here for the Hurricanes. Slavin has that puck now by Niaho. Pulls it across the run. Carlson takes the puck away and now finds a Redskin. Looks it over again, now finding Wilson. Their team goes offside as they will have the first one to take the face off coming up. It's a start run to have everyone's favorite team since they've been coming in here since 2019 was the start and they were born to be on the top threes in between by the Islanders and the Devils along with the Hurricanes. Now I know this was not really the thing that I was looking for because uh, every other team was making it stop and come by. I was expecting that they were really a tough ones to be between. The outs have the call right here as the center ice goes with Boomer. Ovechkin has a lot of it with season in between. As right now with ultimate of Carlson, he has that one with a one-time tee to take his own advantage. On his run, he has a lot of him to take percentage in between. 
Jacob Slavin has the ultimate range to take over with the trap on defensive on a lockdown to have that one right in between. This setup is going to be a tricky one to take from here. Those are the two I know that are going to be playing really hard out there. I'll find one of them if they can try to stop him back. Back to you. Cuba! Oh my goodness! He had three saves in a row and turned it over! Oh, the big one! I really have to say that this is a fun one to have that one. For Kemper Stop, he's making big saves out of him, like at all costs. Wow! Carlson on his way down, thunderclap it, right to stop. That'll be a starting goaltender for the Hurricanes, and now Nekas will have that puck. On the inbound, switch around, Sandit takes it across. In the Cavs run, Press takes it over. Fast gives it over on the outside of a run. Fires away, blocks a shot by Sandin. Back again to Sandin. In across the mouth by Oshie. Stopped by Renta. Puck rally along the boards. Goes right in between and now back again to Stahl. He finally had that one bit. Takes him out. Stahl on his run. Last shot. He scores. Marner with his first goal in appearance has start with a crashing clan run to make a one nothing lead. You know what the pass was turning out that big. After Stoll, he just had to make that one clear. You got to give that one the backhand to Martinet. That was a very hard one. With the ball in bounce, Stoll has to deliver it out. He had that one pass right around Kemper, and this was very tough that he was trying to make that one big here. That set was going to be an open look to take from here. With the win for Hurricanes, he finds Fast. And a delay probably has been whistled, and this one's going to put up for the Caps on the start. Manfa has that signal for a slash, and he's in the penalty box. The first power play will start for the Hurricanes on the run. Ready to take the start, as right now Carlson will have that inbound. Teravainen had that puck inbound. Svechikov under the right wing. Takes a big on bubble as Portis takes it over. Orlov stops the puck here soon. Svechikov, Jarvis with a rebound, comfort stop. Burberry over and down the Portis. Fires it away. Wolves inbound, now we'll have it back to Svechikov. Back again to Ago. Looks to Jarvis. Shot. Right. Stop by Kilpour. Full pressure coming in for the Hurricanes. Ferrari will sling it out into the Kane territory. On a big run. Looking for another one to take here. Terravining with the puck inbound. Fires a shot. Over inbound and right for the glass. Puck leaves his own with only just 13.43 to go. Svechikov finds again as Malastainen takes it over. Turbine has that back. Looking it over on the right side. Looks like he's coming out. This time is almost up. Jarvis shot. Good start made by Cooper. They are back on full pressure as right now the Caps are back into a full strength after a power play is finished for the Kings. Yeah, they're doing really well. Keep on a lockdown defenseman. They were really trying to make that one show up. They're getting that big here and they need to do something else to try to go with the man-to-man -man offense to defense. Carlson! And that goes out of play. Up into the netting. Ready for the faceoff. Signal ready to take on for another face-off. It's a one nothing lead for Carolina. Now win for Stahl. Here's Pest. He finds Sketchy. Marina right on the other side. Vamayas with the puck. 12.05 left to remain in the first period. Oshie around the fender. And Pest takes it over. 
Now get back to stall. A little sketchy. Looks it back to stall. Good stop inbound by Molino. Ocean shot. Where to stop? Touch. Right around the man. Now back to the other way. In the train off to stall. Good stop as Sandman takes over. On towards the left wing. Give a look at Bob. Back hat. Stopped away by Ranta. Now find Fast. In towards the middle. Chuck. And it blocks. Fast recoups the putt. Goes in bound. Blocked by Kemper. Nearing the midway mark of the period. It's still a one nothing lead for Carolina. Looking to tie the run. The big one here for Andre Snatchikov. He has that one all coming out here to make himself to go with a one-time motion. When he has that one inbound, he can try to leave out off with the open gap. This tough one is going to take out everybody's game, but he wants to try to settle it down. This is a tough motion inbound. I will be watching him of how he does with his team of Andre Shnuchikov. His team's going to be a lot that challenging to try to stop any facing, to go with the face-to-face -face look. Not a twist ball, but it might be hard enough to go with in between. Back to you. On to an air face off. The Caps are trailing by one. Now for the win. Birds went down. What a takedown for the Caps. Slavin back to Nikus. Strong takes it over with 9.20 remaining. Back to Jensen. The Caps are in the offense right now as Ovechkin takes it over. Goes bangled out. Carolina back to the other way as Kokenemy gets the spectacle off. 850 remaining. One on one break. Svetika, Skunchy, stop the shot by Skemper. Wilson. Taking ready to go inbound as Drury has it back to Svechikov. Block the shot. Rebound stopped by Kilper. We'll have to wait from here if only 816 remaining in the first. I never seen what Brett Burns does. He was slammed down pretty hard, and I just really did not notice that he was gonna get this one straight away. The teams are all set, ready for another face-off. Back for another win for Washington. Strong back the other way. Pass this to Wilson. Eight minutes remaining as he goes down. Slavin gets pumped out. Strong, oh man, the battle into the center ice. Bunning up across the Drury. Good takeaway as Cooper had that one to make that one pressurize. It looks like that Brock Burns is not going to be able to make it back there. I talked to one of them, and he's going to be out for that game for a while. All right, thanks for the update, fam. Now for the win. Here's number one from Rambis. Rambis right into the center ice, passing along. Milano with the puck. Up across the ocean. Back and wrong. And stopped by Renta. Turbine to give over to Yarvis. Closes the gap. Kuchakov with the puck. Passes. Tries to regroup the entrance into Remus. And to Kuchakov, stop, stop by Greta. Oh man, he's been doing good this time. Bit of good feeling right now. He's making that big save here. Well, it might be a tough one to say. I can't tell that Ranta is that good. Kuchakov wins it. Oh, battle takedown. Battle for the loose puck. In chain and bound. Avo takes it over. Loves him a sliding puck. Now finds Jarvis. Shots. Rebound. Stopped by a kill book. 550 remaining in the first period as they are trying to shut down the Carolina. Milano with the puck. Battling for the loose puck. Orla blocked that shot. Ago to Jarvis, stopped away. Milano, and across from here, finding Kutsakov. Carlson, right towards the back. Swings it across to Kutsakov. 
Oh, she with the puck. Moving the dish inside. Go with the back end. Ranta, pick up another save. Off to Jarvis. Stelled out and now finds Orlov. Back again to Manfa. Inside across. Looks to Phillips. Shot went wide. Beyond the net is D'Angelo. Now we will have it again to stall. The Hurricanes are back into the Caps territory. With the shot. Fired and stopped away to deny that run. Orlov to Marduk. On the pass to Fast. Goes with the takedown. Good play run for Ferrari. Well, that will be a lot of hard in taking him out if he's going to block that one. This is a lot of chop with a hip check motion, but he was trying to make that one move. They can't get away with this one. They have to do this one again. Scooped up a lower board by Ferrari. Ferrari left on Phillips. On a one-on-one -on -one attack, nobody open around. Hurricanes back in transition. Plays it out into the cap territory behind the net. Jensen recovers it. Ovechkin back on ice. With his ship now finding again to Phillips. Phillips gets swaggled down. Wow. Neckers with the punt. And Kuzmosic, Skelper. What a save. You really have to take the bounding. You have to make that time run to go with the water run. This is a motion one to try to hit the deck. With the win, here's Pets. Oh, with the throw down take. And there looks like that nobody is going to take it over this time. And now he's going to do it. Well, this fighting was a lot that hard for the Vetchkin team to try to stable out. And I can't tell you that they were just going to get away with this. This is a lot that challenge that they are never going to get away with this. You have to stop them. And that's what calls a payback. As he goes down, the captain of the, of the team for the Capitals deserves it to take the applause. It's just hard when Tom Wilson was trying to meet up with that and says, Hey, want to fight? That puts up for Jacob Slap to deal with their take run. The five-minute penalty will be putting up for the Caps and the Burger Kings in the penalty box. As right now, the first period is coming down to a wind in to admit that run. Acto will have that across. Jensen will have it across. Get back to Oshi. On a look run, Oshi passes to Jensen. On a cutter down, Jared Ranta got a good piece of it and tried to stay out of it there. We're under a minute remaining in the first, looking to get a goal for the Caps. Aho wins the tip off. Turbine and Big Gut to Awa. Alo again to Jorgis. Jorgis up. And now we'll signal the red penalty whistle here on the Caps as this one's going to be on Jensen. There's two guys for the Caps in the penalty box, and it's not a great choice when you want to take the slash out of it. You don't want to mess this one up, and you can't just try to like leave it out. Carolina will have another take for the power play run with just under 30 seconds remaining in the first period. Sebastian Aho wins the face off and Olaf gives the stretch a gun. Fires away! Cooper stop! Full pressure's on for Carolina as Olaf is in the pen. Over and a run rebound, rebound, Cooper takes it out! Just eight seconds before the first period comes to an end and they are starting to take away the pit pit. Here's another face-off win as Actile gives it over. We'll fling it out and we'll end the first period while the power play resumes for the Hurricanes. Great run on the start. Hurricanes make a one nothing lead over Capitals. That's a lot of great defense work and we'll see how well they do when we come back.
On now to the second period of the game. And here we go. We are about to start now. With the first game of this first period of recap, let's have your take for a fan of how well they did with the Kerr case to try to put up a punch out to try to leave it off with the cross. Oh yeah, I just gotta tell you now, they really have been killing it off. Just a lot of momentum is just not gonna be that easy enough. When, when you can't just make that one recall and work, you just don't wanna make that one feel like it's a lot that hard with the challenging idea. I can tell that when they are really on a tough inbound to try to take a deck. And whenever the Hurricanes are doing this, they're really just trying to make that one feel that they want to do it again. Valenstein lost that puck here and now give it back to D'Angelo. Jarvis with the puck and now back to the offense zone. Give it off to Terravine it. Three groups. Jarvis shot. Stop by Kilper. Just about a minute to play and uh, has passed in the second. And now ready for an our face off. Sebastian Nago has an only third eye ability when he can take at all of his response. He has that open precision to take over it from his team with this offense and has a lot of control to take from here. This is what we are looking for here. Let's hope that Sebastian Nago can get another good string to help the offense pay it off. This is a lot of courtesy of their team to try to make them feel accountable. I'll go back to Nekas. Shot! The punch it almost went in, but it stayed out. Great play for the defensive as McMichaels leaves this puck zone. The Hurricanes are back into the offense as Nekas gets to Ago. Ago to D'Angelo. Oh, look, that one with the heads up collision. Sandin pass to Milano. Looks right towards the right. Finding Kurzakov shot. Oh, right top hit a big save and bound. On the other attack, ready to take the face off. It's still a one nothing lead for Carolina. Kurzakov wins it. Carlson, no fender clap made it, would take to the goal. Sketchy over to the left. Pass to the Arvis. Lost that one here as Carlson takes it over. The Caps regroup their position. Jarvis with a cut inbound. Take that puck away and it goes deflected right toward the board. Milano on a one-on-one -on -one fast break. Pass is broken up. Argo to Martin up. Goes down. Fast. Take that defender. Hit the stop by Kemper. Marduk, fast and sketchy, fires away! Stay fended and denied by the goaltender. Full pressure on for the Carolina. D'Angelo! Went too high and it goes right behind the net. Sketchy, right to fast, shot blocked. And he leaves the puck zone. Now the Cavs takes it over as the Redskin has it across. Fires, he scores! At Fiori, last goal, ties it up! Well, you were both have to say that this was a very tough one to say, I'll tell you. Ovechkin had that one with a pretty cute accuracy motion when he makes a firing bound to go over the limit. His score is turned out that big. I can definitely tell that it was a very hard one to take. Not for all of them at once. He got in pretty well at it. The team has that one with the lead, and now they tied it up in the second period. Malastine to Lundfield. Stop by Wenta. Teams are ready to take that one inbound, and right now it's only 50 or 8 to go in the second period. On his way down, ready for an air face off. It's tied up. Stahl wins it. D'Angelo takes it back to Fast. On a breakaway chain, Arcto will have that puck and bounce. He now swings it over, fires the puck and bound, nine right toward the wall. Slavin right towards it, back down to Martinuk. In towards the right wing, gets punched down. Jensen, he goes down as Arcto will have that one back again to Lapierre. 
in defensive end, Ranta. Not a good connection to take this one, but it still makes a good stop for the goaltender to pick up. Here's how they did. It's a lot of hard percentage with that save as Chopper and Ranta have that heavy hit. A lot of the time they were just doing a lot of much they can, but they were really trying to do is trying to make that connection work. This is what the offense does. His head coach has really been training him for Ranta to try to get ready for the rival games. Without Anderson, it's going to be a very tough one to try to like leave across the zone. But this is not what they were all saying. They really have to make that helpful enough to get ready for the next rival match. When they're ready to take things on, they're going to get this one done and do it straight. Here's strong. Here's good. Goals. Now has their lead up by one. Now that Strom has that team lead, they are just feeling like they're on a pressure. Keep that pass up and then beat that good goaltender. This range is a fire one to take. I can't believe that they're doing this all over it. The Caps are back in the lead as Trevor Redmus has left the assist down. And add that one with under 13 minutes remaining in a second. Now with the win, here's Slavin. Slavin, get to that catch. Save your ball by Kilper. Van Bayes will have that one in the right wing. Over now, back the RA. Goes bumped up. Recovers the puck now, finds Strom, fires, and it goes way off the mark near the goaltender. D'Angelo with the puck, takes a slam, ooh, ho, ho, ho. that's a big takedown. What a great stop. Yeah, I know this is a lot of that hard, but that defense was putting up a lockdown defense. They're going to try to smack from here. Such a golf right back towards the other side with on relentless run and stopped by Cooper. 11.22 remaining in the second period. It's still a 2-1 lead for the Caps. Ready for the face-off. Now they're ready to do this one again on the other way. Akko delivers another face-off win. Good glove saved by Kilper, and it goes with 11.15 remaining. Teams are all set, ready for the face-off. It's still a 2 1 lead as the Caps are up by one. Stop by Kutikov. As Milano will have that puck in bound. He gets fouled out. Now Slavin will have it here. D'Angelo back the air way now, find off home. Pass to Terravainen. Passes across his home. Blocked away as his home sheet takes it over. Here's Milano. In the right way, you're about. Whoa, Ranta got a good piece of it while he went down and he went back the other way. I just couldn't tell, but it was really that tough how hard he was slamming because that defenseman was putting it right away. And this was not that easy enough. They're trying to get away with this. He's slamming past the Jarvis. With a look about, wire fire went wide. Marfa takes over as McMichael has it over now to Jensen. Towards the right, stopped again. D'Angelo finding now to Slavin. Washington's got the puck. Artel, has broken up, fast shot, Cooper stop. Battling for the loose puck in the chain, behind the net, and McMichael will have it. Just 8.35 left to rain in the second period. The Hurricanes are back in the transition as right now, Slavin has it. Deep pass to D'Angelo. Pass on his way motion. Pass to Saul. Cooper stop. Holding in from here as it always comes down to eight minutes remaining in a second. All ready for another face off. And they're ready to take this thing on. I'll never win for Stahl. Ooh! Oh low! Oh my! Is that big slam out gonna take that worst? Take the crap out of it? I just can't believe that this is gonna let this one go into be a big fumble down out there. 
Carlson trying to make a move, but Sketchy takes it over as Martin Del Casa. Now finds Stahl. He now gets back to D'Angelo and now finding Martin up. Snake lifted as Carlson takes it over. He moves inbound, now tries to make it quick. Dovetsky gets shot, blocked away. Strong, get back to Carlson. Back to Wilson. Shot to go to function. Shot stop again by Rata. Sketching to cut Kennedy. Looks now inside with a move around. Stop by the goaltender. Cut Kennedy recoups it. The Angelo shot. And the move goes way off the mark. And it goes back the outside right to Sketchy. Pass broken up. Ovechkin trying to help the team out to stop the run. Sketchy blocked the shot. Way off the mark. For hurry now find Stroh. Carlson, get back to Wilson. Off the Stroh, now finds the Redskin. Look to Hammerin. Right up, make that a big stop. Five minutes remaining in the second period. Now finds Kukinami. In his own entry, finds Svechikov. To hit the yard, Kupper, save him made. D'Angelo now finds Sketchy. He finds Dekas. Shoots! Something bound by Skipper. He'll hold it up with just only 424 remaining. On a great run with the effective run in this use, Caps have a lead 2-1 over Carolina. He goes with another win as the full pressure goes back in. D'Angelo shot. Blocked away as Lapierre will have it away. Fires it across around the net. Here's D'Angelo, he will have it up here. Across and the puck leaves his own. Vermeus will have it here. Moves it quickly to Portas. Protus over in the inbound. Carolina back in the offense zone, end up with the brush. Find Terramine. Three away remaining as Jarvis gives it back to Ajo. And lost that puck this time, now finds Melston. Melston. Give it up quickly in a sketchy, get back to Jarvis. A number one on the top, Kuzikov takes it over. Around the man he goes. Go for a full pursuit, stop away by Ranta, and it goes shot right wide. Sketchy takes it over, stall back with the run. Recovers. In corner and bound, look around, he scores! We are tied, Chester Best helps the team back in. And now they're all even up with the run. You can't just tell that Stahl give it up to Chesper fast that quickly. I got a great replay out of it. When he tried to blind the goaltender, he gave it up right away as Stahl had that one with a good pass. That is why that Chesper fast was giving it over to him, and he had that one to take on the inbound. Their teams are professional, and I must tell you that it's a great way to keep that Jordan Stahl giving up that fast run to give a good look inbound to give that third eye ability a chance to over to Stahl right over again to just for fast. This is whatever happens right here, and this is why they were giving it up that quickly. Puck leaves his own. Now Brandy Sandin. Back to Oshi. He gives it up that quickly, and now Stahl gives it over. Under a minute remaining. Oh, he went Babel down. No lead run take. Phyllis to McMichaels. Your team goes offside, and it's only 41 seconds remaining. Now ready for another face-off before the time period expires. Now the win, as Slavin takes it over. 35 seconds remaining. Slavin, lost that puck as Aptel takes it over. Pass to McMichael. Nekis puts it back to Phillips. Phillips in the inbound, to shoot it away, stopped by Ranta. D'Angelo, and get back to Svechikov. And so that team is putting up a tie ride. Stall, look over to Fast. 
It's a tie game. We'll be right back with you after the break. This is where it all comes down to the final period in capital of the DC. Well, it's been a one wild run, and we're looking to get our next school to beat over the other team. We have a fun one to make that one maintain as Stan stands by with a second period recap. Well, I must tell you this is what everyone does. It's a great way when there is a goal in between, they just really have to feel like they're all over it. But there's the one thing that has to improve it, that just move fast on that really quick move. Line out the goaltender right away, and then have that one to take over right in position. This offense has been going crazy over and under the range. They're trying to make that one clear that they're showing a power play advantage to take it over again. We're going to have to find out if there is another way that they can screw the arc. Ovechkin lost that puck is right now and gives back to D'Angelo. Here's Argo. He will have it right across the Jarvis. Jarvis right towards the right wing as Charles Carlson takes it back. Passes right now again to Ovechkin. Ovechkin with the full pursuit. Goes down and it goes right back the other way. Here's Kutukov. Rebound stopped by Rantum. 17, 20 to go. And back to Cook Enemy. Shot stop. Carl Scooper. Stop made. Oh. Watch out with that in as Carlson tries to back it up. Skeji trying to stop the run. Give to Ferrari. Recovery need to Kutsukov. Back pass Oshi. Shot stop. Blocked away by Rantum. 1638 remaining with only just coming down the way mark line as Ronto got a pretty good decent amount of saves. Now the win puts it back as McDaniels have it across now by Skeji to Svechikov. Tries to get back to D'Angelo. Here's Nickus. On the run, back to Svechikov. Over to Kirkenemy. Now Nekes in the wing. Power procession. Chopper stop. 16 and 1 remaining in the third period. Now ready for a face off. It's still tied up. Looking for a net goal to take the lead. The Hurricanes win another face off as McMichaels has that puck back. He's on the pressure. Pass to Phillips, shot, ooh, oh, that's close, but Ranta had that stop. Running for the faceoff, as they will have to stop the play bound with just 15.34 left. They're really on a fresher run, I must tell you that home games and their caps are a fun one to watch. I think we should see them again for the next season or two. Well, we might find out what it is now. Yeah, pretty true it is. Here's Martin up. Toward the right wing, the fast shot! Something way by Kilper! Two time stop! Phillips recovers it. Martin to get back to stall. Hurricane still going. D'Angelo! Blocked away as Kilper made overstock. Here's Stahl. Finds Slavin. Blocked and goes down. Fast recovers back to Slavin. Slavin to Stahl. Vanis will have that one back and bound by McMichael and now fast will recover it. Looks in hurt! Shot stop again by Kilper. Now the Caps will have their possession. Carolina back the airway. Pop for a rebound. Taken for the loose buck in the chain. Cross up. Manfa recovers it. Now finding Phillips. Pass broken up. Jeremiah on the way down with a 2 on 1 attack. With a sketch move up again. Clock catched away by Kilpo. That's a great inbound. And I must tell you that it was a lot of great hustle making. When Jeremiah had that switching mount, he wants to cover up it instead. He just made that one feel like easy enough. And he wants to make that one feel good and got that one a good one to take a shot and stop him out. Now, Wilson will have that in range. On the run! Stop again by Ranta. 
Jarvis with the puck. On the full presser attack, Tara Vinan shot, blocked away as Ovechkin takes it over. Wilson recovers it with 12 remaining. Oh, picked up, big bound. D'Angelo stops inbound. Passes again to Jarvis. Hurricanes on a fast break run. Shot, stop a jumper on the pad. Ferrari now find Carlson. Moves across, back to for Harbury. Schroll on his way down. 1 on 1 attack. Gets punched out. Ago back to Teravainen. To Jarvis. Moves the pressure for the wing. Stop away by Kilper. Oh, she back the air away. Hawk lost that one as Jarvis has it back. Good stop by the goaltender. Valley with at least puck, now find Slavin. Slavin! Oh ho ho! Man oh man! We got a great battle in between from here, and I love this one. This goes with a hustle takeover. A lot of taking great inbounding. This is not easy at all. Can't just get away with that. Milano, puck with the recover, finding Kutekov. Carlson Thunderclap! Three mount puts up! He scores! There's the leadoff run for the first time as Kuzakov has that goal after Carlson assist. It's a great hustle in your battle. I must have to tell you this one. There was a lot of great percentage here for Kuzakov to take his own time. When he has that one inbound, he passed it off right across again and again to Ranta. He had to make that one a lot of lead. This is a turnout knockoff run, but he is picking up bad. Capitals are back in the lead with a free two run under a midway mark of the period. Now the win as Sketchy has it. Over now, fighting again to Kukkenemy. Kukkenemy lost that one as Milano gives back to Kutikov. Pass Oshi. Oshi lost that one as Kukkenemy takes it back as Dekas has it away with nine minutes remaining. Send it back to Pernas. Washington's got a lot across the board. Send it. Past the blue line. In the middle. Passing red tail one hole. And he will stop that one with only 8.30 left to remain the third. Now we're in our face off right to take him bound. Washington's been the best part of the game. He had the lead up by one. Pernas shot. Way too wide on that one. Sketchy kicks the putt. Back to D'Angelo. Pass to Nekas. In from blue line. LaPerry will have an inbound. Gives a dish. Right over now to Pernas. Goes to the 1-1 one -one break. Oh! Red time! My oh my! He's still not going to give up this time. Well, it's a great inbound. I must tell you, the protest was going to beat him. He's going to put up on grass. But it's a great stop. You just have to believe him. Jarvis back to Sketchy. Fires away. Jumper stop. Send in over now to the Perry. Millston right over and now into the left wing. Stopped inbound. D'Angelo. Lost that one. Turbine and gives it over. Now finding Avo. Hurricanes back into the Caps territory. Dish off to Jarvis. Kelper hold it through here and with only six or seven to remain. It's still a 3-2 game. Here's an our win for Stahl. First shot, way wide off the mark. Sketchy get back to Martin and not find D'Angelo shot. First rebound, way off wide. Oh, Kelper, man, oh goodness, he is like good. He's going to try to defeat it all. Well, don't want to get away with that. I just never really figured this was going to be a hard one to take. But this is a lot of pressure that they're doing this. Now for the win, you stall. Wow, that takedown turned out to be a Peter. Puck leaves out of the crease. 
And Strong will give it over now to Carlson. Looks at Ovechkin. Oh, he would have had that one in there. And he will have to count it in. Alex Ovechkin with two goals in his game. Felt like the puck was going to be in there. Well, I must have got to tell you, man, he was trying to rebound it with his own time. Because that shot was going to be on the backhand, he just really wanted to like, try to beat the gun slant up. They would have challenged that uh, call. If it, even if he would have been in the crease, they should have had to count that one. Because if it was a goal, they're not going to count that one right away. They're, they're having a hard time to do this. Now the win comes in for Stroh and now finds Carlson. Pass to Wilson. Fires the cross. Rebound. Oh, he wouldn't get that one away. Ovechkin looking for three. And Fast takes it away. He's up for the run shot. Oh, Kemper shuts him down this time. And this one is going to be a tough one to go with the breakaway chain. Let's have a look as one team puts up. For Boomer. Yeah, this is a great thing to say. My 1T is all in motion. I love when Ovechkin is putting up a lot of great timing and his ability. His offensive run has been turning great. And it's all that has been turning out one by one. Not everybody can. And Ovechkin, he might have it all to take over 800 goals. Jump shot! Wilson with the rebound, stopped by Ranta. Otto give it back over again and now find Jarvis. Jarvis passed the Taravani shot, hit it off the pad, go right to the wall. Taravari, now find Milano. Take the pass to Oshie, stopped away by Ranta. Taravani, battling in the blue line. Pass to D'Angelo. Slab in, but a lockdown, stopped by Ramco, never huge save. Milano into the left wing. Shuts him down into the corner. 2 pretty left to remain in the third period. Svechikov needs to get up. And Vagmayesh with the puck. After a save made by Kemper, they have been a better one than they have. Kutzikov in the backhand. Great to pick up another huge save. 2 0 2 remaining, and I think in the next rival week will be happening here. So keep your eyes peeled for the next one coming up. Well, I'm thinking this one's going to be a next matchup. Let's have the Devils and the Rangers together. The Battle of the Turnpike. Well, <laughs> well, I guess it might be a great thing that we can go for. We'd love to do that. Well, it might be one thing at a time because they have been a one part of a team. Or we could have another team. The Islanders and the Rangers. Well, that would be a good one. Battle of New York will be no problem at all. No problem, no sir, ain't no. Bad <laughs> my ears with the puck. Just about one minute remaining as the Caps been an awesome courage to take their night for Ovechkin and the team. And D'Angelo with the puck now find Terabinen. The man advantage is on for the Hurricanes and Sandy get the Wilson. Gonna go deep. Way off the mark. And Milano keep it over. Makes it in. That's the end of the run. It's all what the backhand does because Sonny Milano had that one with a deep shot and turns it over. That's how you end it. And that's where it comes over. Kuchikov wins the face-off as Carlson gives it back. Off to Sutsikov. Back to Carlson's shot. Rebound! Carvinen with the puck. Down to their last position. But the shot is stopped it again! What a play inbound. And Aushi and her team wins it all. Cardinals destroy the Hurricanes run. A 5-2 is your final score. What a game. Yeah, you could say that Kemper and Ovechkin, they're really on a dominant run. They did a great play on this night. And just to tell you that now, they are on their slot game balls. It's a great way to end their game. But saluting fans, we can't get 
We can't be able to see them how they do. All right and every day. Along with OJ and Fan and Boomer, I am your host, and this has been Turn Out to Be a Fun One. Thanks for watching, so we'll see you next time. OJ Fang says, right now the three star players of the game are on, as there are no current status right now, as Alex Ovechkin had two goals in this game to put up another run in the second star. Only had six hits and turned out with a bunch of rebounding saves and turned out big. And your first star goes out with Darcy Kemper with 60 saves in the game. Only got into a great run of a hustle. Here are the total statistic runs here on the other side as we have 62 over 37 for Carolina Hurricanes. 56 over 54 was the run for the hits of Washington. Time on attack was 723 over 446 for Carolina. 93 passing percentage over 90 for Washington. 26 over 17 for Carolina with the faceoff wins. 5 minute major penalty for a fighting of Carolina and 9 minute penalty kill was on Washington. No power play goals in between as they only had played it on the ice for 4, minutes, for four minutes on each period. Well that determines to be the end of this one. Hope you like this one game. If you don't, we got a next one coming in and I'm thinking you will never know. Thanks for watching I hope I'll appreciate you with another next Rival Week game on next week. Peace out everyone for a while as the NHL Rival Dial on EA Sports. This is Son of Beast. You can follow me on my social media. I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and X. Link to my about page. And be sure to like the video and comment down below if you have any recommendations you want. And hit the notification bell. It's the best way to support to this channel. All the work to do the blooming with all the best thing of our own. Anyways, have a great night everybody and have a safe trip home to go for our next game to be back in action. Centipede out. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.